so you've come back for another adventure in what sold this week on eBay. This one is for the first week of July 2021, and we'll start off with the more hilarious adventures of Paddington Bear. This was a five book boxed set that I paid 10 cents for. And let's see, I listed it February 7th. It sold July 1st for, I took a best offer. I might even send an offer out. Six dollars plus shipping. And if you've watched my recent videos, you'll know why. Okay, next. If I can get my mouse to work. Here we go. There we go. World Without Cancer. I've sold this is a third one of these I've sold recently. Uh, let's see, this one I paid a dollar twenty nine for this. That was probably at Goodwill. I listed it. June 26th, it sold July 2nd for $12.20 plus shipping. Easy enough. Okay, let's see. And we have an old hickory uh, carbon steel butcher knife. Let's see. I like selling these for some reason, but this came from uh, this came from that $250 uh buy that I made and uh, so I paid three dollars and sixteen cents for this item it was listed May 5th it sold July 2nd for 12 bucks plus shipping next uh, it, just a railroad track just one little piece of railroad track came out of a box of railroad, HO railroad tracks that I bought I paid a buck and a half for this piece and let's see I listed it. I listed it July or June twenty third. It sold July second for seven dollars, six ninety nine plus shipping for that one lonely track. And there's a couple of glass baked mugs from Marine Land with uh, what is it? What, well, I don't know who can can do and Nutka or orcas, different orcas on those uh, cups. Anyway, I had these. I think I had these for a while. Let's see. Uh, I paid a dollar ninety-eight for the pair. They were listed, yeah, August August ninth, two thousand twenty. So August ninth last year, they sold July second, and I got ten bucks. I got ten bucks. So I was taking half off or less prices going on here. So I know these must have been offers that I sent out. There's too many in a row there. Okay, next, Power Rangers. These came in up. Let's see. I bought a bag of. A bag of toys and these were in it. The bag, the whole bag, cost me five dollars. So the rest of the stuff basically um, was, I guess, free. Everything else that was in the bag. So these were five bucks. I listed them June tenth. They sold July second for thirty dollars plus shipping. Thirty bucks plus shipping. Okay. And let's see. If I remember right, the Red Ranger, his leg was. His leg was broke. I did take pictures and it says, yeah, yeah, Red Ranger has a broken leg. Yep. Next. It's a Smurfette. It's a Smurfette coffee mug. I, I had this for a while too. Let's see. I paid 79 cents for this at the Goodwill. Uh, it was listed March 5th, 2016. So five years ago. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah, five years ago. Yeah, I listed it five years ago. That's crazy. It sold July 2nd for $14.95 plus shipping. It's a good thing it doesn't need anything. Ah, uh, these are some books. I got these in a bag lot, I think, at, uh, at I'm going to say at, at the niche, I believe it was. And uh, I paid a dollar for this lot of books. Uh, the bag lot was probably $5 for the bag, but uh, and I probably parted it out into uh, five different five different lots but so anyway yeah uh, I just included these basic these are basically I just threw in I knew they weren't that great but I thought well they'll just they'll they'll, they'll pay for the bag which they, you know more than did so um, yeah I listed them May 30th they sold July 2nd for 699 plus shipping so they paid for everything else even though I'm sure that uh, the other things actually I'm um, no, they're a different one, yeah. I won't talk about that. All right, Cowabunga, dude. Uh, this is, uh, this is, uh, 
let's see, Mike the Sewer Surfer. And he's got his little, he had little things there with him, a little crab and a throwing star, I think it is, and uh, and that uh, little surfboardy thing going on there. So let's see, three dollars and sixteen cents I paid for him. Listed May eighth, sold July third for fifteen dollars plus shipping. So that again, that was part of that 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 really great pick that I got to do. So uh, that was a that's that's been just that just keeps. I forget what I I I, I figured it out what how much I've made on that. It was almost a thousand dollars. Yeah, almost. Well, and if you count the stuff that I took to the shop, it still hadn't quite reached a thousand yet. That's right, I did. It was nine hundred and something. So, uh, I did all right with that stuff. So, and there's still there's still quite a bit left. So, that was cool. Next, and this little 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 starfish guy here. He goes with uh, he goes with uh, the these Ninja Turtle things. And this guy is crazy. I I paid three sixteen for him as well because he was part of that deal. Um, he's just a little thing, but I listed him again May 8th. He sold July 3rd for $8.99. Plus shipping, $8.99 plus shipping for that little star thing. That's cool. All right, next. Just call me. So, old, uh, I think it's a, it's a, it's a teen romance. It, it wasn't Sweet Dreams, though. But it is a it is a teen romance from the '80s, and I mean, if you get them cheap enough, they they usually sell okay. I don't know what teen why teen romance from the '80s is so good, but um, I was there. I didn't think teen romance was great then either. So anyway, uh, six cents. So that's I'd call that buying it right. Six cents I paid for this, and I'm sure that this came. Probably it doesn't say there anywhere, but yeah, so I paid six cents and listed it. Well, I listed it July 3rd. It sold July 3rd, sold the same day. That's that's I have that happen a lot with the, with these old teen romances. Now, I, there was other ones listed, so it's not like and it was 5 dollars free shipping, so I didn't I didn't really make too much on that, so to be honest, so. Uh, I just grabbed it because I knew of, of what it was, and so I just there was other ones there that that were listed, so uh, so I knew the price was pretty much about where it was going to go. So eh, that's the way it goes. That's the way it goes. So let's see next, and this is an old plastic ornament, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, this was something that came in a. A box of Christmas ornaments that were given to me. It's quite. It's it, it's it's vintage. Um, let's see. I listed it February tenth. It sold July third for eight dollars and forty nine cents. Wow. I really cut that one, didn't I? Cut it. I told you I was selling stuff for half price, man. Pretty much. I was I was sending out offers. Eight forty nine plus shipping. Yeah, plus shipping. Next. It's a good thing I did too, because I got pretty beat up. Uh, this week wasn't the best either, so let's see. This is another piece of uh, HO train track things. These are bumpers for the end of tracks. So these came out of that same box that I, I think I may have mentioned last week that I sold the whole box. I paid 15 bucks for the whole box, and I sold sold the whole box minus the things that I listed on. I, I sold the whole box at the shop for 30 bucks. So uh, you know, all this stuff really is basically free, but uh, you know. I, I parted it out and said, yeah, this is how much it is. So, uh, buck fifty. I must have gotten. I think I must have gotten ten listings out of it. That's why they're priced a buck fifty. So yeah, because I must have gotten ten listings out. So anyway, yeah. You didn't need to know that. June twenty third is when I listed it. It sold July fourth for nine dollars. Nine dollars plus shipping on these little guys, and that was a good deal. Fear Street. Um, paperback book. Or I'll sign again. And uh, again, six cents I paid for this one, and I listed it July third. It sold July fourth for sixteen ninety nine plus shipping for this little paperback book. Very cool. That 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 was a, that was a good sale. I was I was thrilled with that one. So cool. Next, big Boeing FMC user's guide. This I got I got this for free. I. Uh, yeah, it was at a, a, a property that I cleaned out, I, I believe. Yes. 
a long time ago and I just recently found it in a tote that I was going through of something I pulled out of the garage from from that house I cleaned out. It's it's probably five, four or five, at least five years ago now, I'm thinking, that I cleaned that property out and I'm still finding stuff that got buried. Um, I'm pretty cool that I'm pretty happy that I found it because, you know, I listed it on uh, June 16th and it sold July 5th for 50 bucks plus shipping. So, um, yeah. Yeah, really, I'm, I, I am, I am picking away at, at my old stuff that's laying around. Bits and pieces here and there, hopefully I'll get it cleaned up. It's going to be a while though. Next. Star Wars, Star Wars, uh, The Phantom Menace, this is a, uh, I think it's just a DVD, yeah, just a DVD. Let's see, it was brand new yet, it hadn't never been opened, and I have here that I paid nothing for it. Um, I don't really know where it came from. I think it came from something I cleaned out, property I cleaned out or something, and I just had it sitting over here on the one shelf. I think I was hoping to, hoping to get the other two from the second trilogy, and uh, from the prequels, and it just never happened. So I just finally went and listed it one day. Uh, let's see. So I listed it July 4th. It sold July 5th. So for $11.90 with free shipping. So I'm still didn't make a whole lot on it but it's no longer on my shelf it's on someone else's shelf and that's a good thing dragon star this is a series uh called dragon star by melanie ron i don't think it was super popular but they were sitting here because i got them in a bag lot somewhere so i don't remember what i paid for them anymore so i, I have zero they there was a bag that was in the i think that was in my closet here and I just finally got around to it and I, so I don't know what I paid for them anymore but they got listed March 19th last year last year and they sold July 5th for five bucks five bucks plus shipping and I'm happy uh, that I love it when that old stuff that I had sitting around sells that just makes me so happy I'm so happy yes and <laughs> little West Side Story going on there uh, Two glass canning jar lids. A pair of glass canning jar lids. I paid two dollars and twenty cents for these. Two dollars and twenty cents. They were listed March fifteenth. Two dollars and twenty cents for the pair. They were listed March fifteenth. They sold July fifth for fifteen dollars and ninety eight cents plus shipping for the pair. So that was cool. I'm not selling a lot of those. I don't sell too many. Um, it's okay. And it's okay. Remember, I used to have you know, two or three of these a week, but it is what it is. All right, next. Annihilation. I don't know anything about it. It looks like a silver surfer. It doesn't look like the silver surfer. It is silver surfer. And Thanos. Thanos. Okay, there he is. I think it's a graphic. I think it's a graphic comic or something like that. Anyway, uh, I paid $2.49 for this at the Goodwill. I listed it. June 27th, it sold July 5th for $30 plus shipping. Yay. That's a good sale. Alright, this thing here, I don't know if you can see there, but below the picture that you can see, there's a, a little photo down there that doesn't have anything but a couple of blank Polaroids in the picture. That's because that's my gallery picture, and and apparently a bunch of my gallery pictures, some of my other pictures, just vanished. Just went away. Um, it was there when I listed it, but it's gone now. So it was actually gone when it was sold. The guy that bought it bought it without even seeing the picture, the main picture of the thing. But it was sealed, so you know, you know, he was, and it was described that there was a little, a little. Was, well, I guess it says new, but and it was new because it was sealed. The box is a little, a little bit worn though. But anyway. Uh, three dollars and sixteen cents I paid for that because it was part of that deal. And again, May fifth I listed it, sold July fifth, and I only got eight bucks. Took a best offer, eight bucks plus shipping, and that's fine. I'm so far in the green on that stuff now that that uh, it, it's okay. It's all right. I didn't. I don't think I had it listed for much more than that anyway. Ah, uh, some more R.L. Stein books. These aren't. These aren't. I don't think as great, but hey. Uh, you know, I paid three. No, I paid uh, 
14 cents. 14 cents for the lot. Um, isn't that great? 14 cents. I listed them June 7th. They sold July 6th for $13 plus shipping. So, um, that's not bad. What is that? That's four, four thirty a piece or something like that. Four thirty-three a piece. That's pretty cool. For paperbacks, I mean, you know. All right, next. All right, this is a model that I got out of that 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 two fifty sale, but. What happened here is I listed it. This is for parts only. This was just for parts because a lot of the car wasn't there. But there was there was parts that were like the I think the hood is still here and uh, the wheels and the the hub the hub hubcaps hub wheel covers and uh, some other pieces like that. And so this guy came in and asked me if I would just sell him those parts. Just to, there was like three or four parts that he wanted out of it, and I was like, "All right, okay." So, um, so, I, so I, so I did do that, and then I, I did relist it, and later on, but uh, so I, I took the three sixteen and I cut it in half and made it a dollar fifty eight. So a dollar fifty eight I paid for this one, and I listed it May eighth. It sold July sixth, and I got I did get five ninety nine for. Uh, just the the just those few pieces not the box or any of that other just those few pieces so so that was cool and i think i cut the guy a deal on shipping i, I may have given him a deal on the shipping because uh it, w it was just going to be it was only going to be first class instead of i think that this might be priority i don't know but i cut him a deal on shipping so uh yeah i'm pretty sure that's what the deal was there so okay next this is a this is a pretty little uh, ivy and vines kind of looking. Uh, it was a Lefton piece, so uh, some Lefton pieces can be pretty good. This was good enough. I don't know where it came from. I think I may have gotten it. I don't have a price down for what I paid for it, so I think I may have gotten it from a friend of mine when he got out of the business there a couple of years ago, and I went to his house and just bought a whole ton of stuff from him. And I didn't I didn't figure out I didn't figure out how much how much each price was for I did I didn't figure it out so anyway uh, this was listed let's see here September 28th last year September 28th 2020 and it sold it sold uh, July 7th for 10 10 99 plus shipping so 11 bucks plus shipping so is what it is next this is cool this old old yellow yellow bird Yellow bird hair dryer. I don't know how how, how old. It, I'm thinking 80s. It, don't it look 80s to you? It's got to be 80s. I mean, look at that thing. It's a monster. Um, anyways, yeah, a couple of attachments with it. I paid two dollars and fifty cents for this at the thrift store. I paid two dollars and fifty cents, and I listed it. I almost left it sit, and I thought, wait a minute. I've sold hair dryers before, not often, mind you. But I don't even know if you guys have seen any. But I know I've sold some before. Anyway, I listed it June seventh. It sold a month later, July seventh, for forty dollars plus shipping, thirty nine ninety nine plus shipping on that. So that was pretty thrilling. And let me tell you what this had, this thing has some. It has some. It has some power. You turn that thing on, and it it's got some force behind that blow when you turn it up. And the and the hot is actually hot, hot. It's I mean you could you could probably burn you could probably burn yourself. It's so hot. So. <laughs> Anyway, so I, I did test it. So next, okay, ice can ice cream, uh, homemade you know thing for making homemade ice cream. This is just a lid off the canister that that the, uh, the ice cream it gets made in. So this is just the lid off that. I parted it out. Um, it says here I paid nothing for it. I think it's because I had a couple of these in the garage. And I think they came from that same house that I cleaned out like five years ago, and I just never got around to them. And finally, uh, I finally I got I did get them parted out. So I didn't pay anything for it. I listed it March 31st. It sold July 7th for 8.99 plus shipping for this piece. Next, Ozzy, there he is, live and loud, Ozzy. 50 cents I paid for this. Listed it. 
July 1st till July 7th for nine bucks. Nine bucks plus shipping. Hey, that's pretty cool. And last, I think the last thing we sold this week was Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. There he is. Uh, it was obviously a used, uh, used VHS tape, and I, I, I don't have anything on here for what I paid. It was free. I, I don't know where it came from. All right, so I think actually I think it came from, oh, there were, yeah, there was a big box of videotapes out in the free stuff over at the niche. I mean, there must have been, oh, there must have been at least, I'm gonna say. 40 tapes in there and I just grabbed the whole box and took them in the van and brought them home and and I just started listing them um, But you know, I, I actually you know some of them some of them weren't any good. So but I think I probably listed about oh, Maybe 15 of them or so something like that. I don't remember exactly how many I listed but uh, I don't know if I could find that out. I don't know if it matters uh, July, 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 July. Let's scroll down here to July, July. Okay, there's uh, that's not it. Where are they? There's the zeros. All right, so nope, that's not it. This one, nope, that's not it. Uh, they're not here. They're here somewhere, but oh, here they are. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, there was some Barney ones, you know, those aren't it. There's, well, there, yeah, there's a lot. I must have, at least 20, at least 20 of them. So that, uh, and then I took the rest back and put them in the free spot. And they went away. I noticed they were gone, so somebody else is doing videotapes. Which is okay. I got the one I wanted. So anyway, I, the ones I wanted, I, I actually only got $5.99 for it, so with free shipping so i didn't actually make very much on it but you know the hope is that you know the algorithm likes it and you get more sales unfortunately it's been it was quite quite slow in july i don't know if it even ever picked up no it didn't week 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 uh yeah it it is it, bad so anyway i paid 35 dollars and 33 cents for everything that i sold this week that's 35 dollars and 33 cents is what i paid and my gross sales were three hundred and seventy eight dollars and thirty eight cents so there's no returns no no uh non-paying bidders no cancellations three hundred seventy eight dollars and thirty eight cents for the week so yeah that works for me it's good enough i can handle that i wish it was more but you know i wish a lot of things uh that's not it though so all right i hope you enjoyed the video Take care. Have a great day. Keep listening, and I'll see you next time.